it's part part three of of this shit. Now it's interesting. The first two zones have been basically all dwarves. Now we're going to a group of humans that are gonna probably follow Anduin. It's kind of weird. Like, where is Illyria uh, and Thrall gonna fit into this? I mean, I'm, I get together with my friends, like, once every what couple months. Aside from, like, doing more golfing recently, just in preparation for my friend's golf outing, which ended up never happening because his flight got delayed, which is hilarious, but funny, but very hilarious. I, it's not that often. Anyway, I'm the hallowed path. I'm glad our paths have crossed. Adelgon has been telling me about a cavern called Hallowfall. She's told me the people there are called the Arathi. I cannot imagine that they are related to the ancient human kingdom, but it can't be a coincidence. Adelgon's people had fruitful contact with them some time ago. Whatever happened, I hope to repair that relationship and gain their aid. Please meet me at the Hollowfall Gate. I hear a radiant song. But we have I'm not no sure. His flight was delayed way. by over like five hours or something. Culture was and um, so he the, he missed the tea time. So all the prep we did was for nothing. As well. Thank you for your help, Adelgon. So it, it, it's just kind of hilarious. It's tr it, it sucks, but it's still <coughs> hilarious. <coughs> okay. Well, it was like a week or two ago, I think, <coughs> at this stage. So could have been, I don't know. By the light, it shines as brightly as the sun. Are those airships? But we're underground. I don't see any airships. Where am I where am I supposed to see airships, Anduin? Ready. Alright, let me get him tucked in a little bit. One second. Such a funny guy. Oh wait, what? My ooh, speak with Anduin. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, are we go. We're just going down there. Am I needed? All right, I am ready. I hear the radiant song. Oh, there's the. Is airship. it coming from that crystal? Meet Arathi in Dunel's Kindness. Like, I'm gonna know what that's called. Just, uh, it should just say follow Anduin or something. Oh, there's the flight glyph. Easy grab. Yoink. Anduin, did you get lost? Anduin. The Arubians breached the Aegis Wall, Farron. The darkness forced us back. Your fear of the dark will kill us all, General. We'll never survive unless... Quiet, Lamplighter. Outsiders are here. Who are you? Who am I? Who am I? I am the guardian of lost souls! Service Friendly outsiders are not common in Hallowfall, only enemies emerging from the shadow. But you seem comfortable in the light, despite how unusual you may appear. I would welcome you were we not in the midst of a crisis. We carry the flame Many in Hallowfall will call you outsider. I would call you friend. Well, that was quick. I'm the goddamn avatar! No. 
I would also ask for your help. If you are no stranger to combat, desperate times forge strong friendships. General Steelstrike ordered the army to fall back from the Nerubian onslaught. In doing so, she abandoned a lamp lighter and many troops of the darkness. I may not be able to save them on my own, but with your help, I may succeed. If you're willing, ride with me or meet me there. Be strong, my friend. I'm Farron, Lamplighter of Halafor. I have a relief cart prepped for the war. Will you join me? Anduin, I'm an adventurer, exploring Kazalgar with my friend. An adventurer? I'm King of Stormwind, motherfucker! All right, let's hop in. Let's let's ride with them and get the little chit chat. Is that crystal. Star. We call it a star. Belladar, the Emperor's vision of holy light. A vision of light, deep under the ground. We're the Hallowfall expedition of the Arathi Empire. We followed our Emperor's sacred vision across the sea to fight in Renalash. The final battle between light and dark. There's like Ragnarok. As we crossed the sea, we were caught in a storm. The fleet was uh, enveloped in golden radiance. In a flash, our entire armada was transported down here. You've been down here fighting the Norubians ever since? I was just a child. The only child when we were marooned. The Nerubians have never ceased their hostility. They crawl up from their kingdom, seeking a fight, and try to drag us down into the darkness. Steel Strike's army does well beneath Belladar's light. Those bugs are good at extinguishing hope. We lamplighters have trained to charge into the darkness. We save those who are lost and keep the Dawn Towers lit. They could have they could have chosen a better name than lamplighters like beacon guardians or I don't know lamplighters Great Chiron you're alive Farron your courage acquits you well young lamplighter you are right to be afraid I'm not afraid you're afraid Not all who wanted the Outsider, the Nerubians took us by surprise. The army went into retreat when the wall was breached. I've been keeping them away from this tower, but I could certainly use your help. We venture into shadow. Who are you, Chiron? I served the Empire for many years before coming to Hollowfall as a warden in our military. When we first arrived in Hollowfall, I volunteered to lead a group in scouting the land. We found what areas were defensible, what was overrun by Nerubians and the Cobis. Uh, I don't know what a Cobus is, and laid a foundation for the defense of Meridar. Mereldar. That's an L. I found my calling late in life, bound to a, a star of prophecy in an unlikely land beneath the ground. And I would see all those that walk in the light of the sacred flame survive another day. Tell me about the lamplighters. It's not easy to face darkness, you know, it's, it's dangerous. It's not easy to face darkness, you know, is dangerous. That's even more true in a cave. We lamplighters are the ones who brave the darkness to make sure Rathi Dawn Towers are lit and our people are safe. Illumination illusionists? <laughs> we frequently have strong disagreements with the military, but we're free to do what we believe we must. We're few in number, to be sure, and our willingness to face the darkness in spite of our fears is seen as unusual. But when a lamplighter arrives, the Rathi's hope grows brighter. So they're like a subsection of the military that doesn't get along with the other ones. So kind of like our army, navy, marines, all that stuff. They, I mean, they all work together, but they secretly have little grudges against each other. In Tunnel trouble. Others, it's good to have new allies here. Together we have much better chances of protecting this tower. The Nubians have overwhelmed us. If we're going to have any chance against them, we need to destroy the burrows they're using to come under the wall. If you can handle that, we will survey the field from the top of the wall and meet you there. Destroy six Nerubian burrows. The flame brings hope. The brightness brawlers, yes. A brings hope. It's hard to let's see. No, really. if you are lost one darkness, dawn tower has fallen, but a faint help. glimmer of hope remains with the smaller key flame atop the wall. The shattered remnants needed to sustain that light were taken by the Nerubians. Gather remnants from the Nerubians 
You slay and help ignite a beacon of hope. Don't the Dawn Tower won't be enough to hold them back. The Nerubians have gotten braver. The we brilliant must berserkers. The flame on the wall. Its sacred flame will keep the Nerubians. The bombastic again. beacon brawlers. I really wish they didn't make that change of making the enemies take longer to kill. Like, I don't I, I like I don't mind two shotting the enemies while I'm leveling. Like this is just a pain in the butt, Blizzard. Why'd you do that? Ooh, the Radiance Reapers, I like that. That's a good one. But yes, I do genuinely enjoy World of Warcraft still. I'm hoping that this expansion in the, uh, the World Soul Saga will, will rekindle everybody's love for Warcraft, but we'll see. We will see. So far, I've been enjoying the stories. Ooh, the Prism Pugilist, yeah. Can even add like the the, pri the Prime Prism Pugilist. I mean, like, can we just agree that Lamplighters is just kind of lame? Like, just just a little lame. Like, I get it, I understand it. It's not meant to be like crazy or anything, but it is just a little lame. Like, it's just a little lame. Some BS from Kingdom Hearts? True. And we all know any bullshit that comes from Kingdom Hearts is bad. Just need one more. Like, honestly. And, and Blizzard recently in an update up the uh, the damage that the that the like up the HP and all that kind of stuff that these mobs have because like the early access people's questing was like too easy or too quick and it's like bro like all this does all all they manage to do is piss off the fan base for that. Really? Kingdom Hearts 3 was that bad? I didn't know it was that bad. The sacred flame don't trust our spirit. Excellent. If we don't have to worry about the Nubians stabbing us in the back, we can deal with those pouring through below. We must confront the darkness. I will see you through the shadow. With the light of the flame, I see hope that we will drive the Nubians back. A beacon in the dark. Good people died here today. A lot of them. Every Arathi soldier carries a tinderbox. It represents their devotion to the sacred flame. Many use it as a focus to bring forth the flame's light in the dark places beyond the light of Beladar. The sacred flame brings hope. With an Nerubian attack, we can't recover their bodies, so we must retrieve these symbols. To venerate their sacrifice, 
to venerate their sacrifice. Then use this torch to burn their bodies. It's the best funeral we can offer. Despite we Arathi are consecrated in the sacred flame, do not leave my people on the field. I mean, you're the one who could go rescue your people, Fear but whatever. The, the only good Follow spider is a dead one! If we don't stem the tide of Nerubians climbing up to us, nothing else will matter. Their numbers are just too great. We need to delay their onslaught to buy the people of Hollowfall time to prepare. The wall still serves as an effect very effective choke point. Do what you can to thin their numbers. We help those lost to the darkness. Really? That's kind of crazy. I wonder why they did that. I wonder why they did. They, did they just have a disagreement with Square, but they wanted to? They wanted to make Kingdom Hearts three anyway. There's got to be some kind of explanation for it. Tinder box. Okay, this is a Tinder box. Oh, they want me to burn their body and and bring back the tinder box. Okay. All right. What is this Ashkahet's whisper? What is this? Slurp. You move quickly in the cold darkness that covers you. Increase haste and damage by fifty percent and damage taken by fifty percent. Okay. So I become a berserker essentially. It was hard to find room? It was hard to find room? Oh. So they basically, they never planned for the Final Fantasy characters to be one of the main draws. And they felt that they didn't need to anymore because Kingdom Hearts was done. They established their characters and so they didn't need FF characters anymore, but then come to find, oh, I guess the fan base really liked it. Yeah, but that original story has, you know, like, ties to the Final Fantasy characters, too. Like, what's Kingdom Hearts 2? I think it's Kingdom Hearts 2. Is it Kingdom Hearts? Maybe it's Kingdom Hearts 1 without Cloud, the Sephiroth fight, all that jazz, right? Like, Cloud, Tifa, that whole dynamic with, with Sephiroth. Like, that's a huge thing. That's one of the most memorable things about the Kingdom Hearts game. Is, like, that design of Cloud number one, you know? Okay, so she was in Kingdom Hearts 2. Okay, because Cloud was, like, looking for her or something. I've never played Kingdom Hearts 2. I've only seen, like snippets but like cloud was like looking for her or something or she was looking for him one of the Shadow something like that rules, lamplight is rise. oh he was a battle okay so i remembered him in kingdom hearts one and i'm like okay so they i didn't think that they had him in kingdom hearts two so i thought all that went down to kingdom hearts two i or kingdom hearts one yeah in my heart thank you I'm you've sorry. helped to honor these their sacrifice as well as we can we carry these were true arathi Holding onto hope in the very heart of shadow. All right, the only good there. This is a good start. There are still many more Nerubians they coming from below, but we must turn our attention to those now. already inside Hollow. Come, their killers still live. We are right. light. It's critical with so many Nerubians pouring through the Aegis Wall that that we defend our airships docked at Tenir's ascent. 
the, the Nerubians have always outnumbered us, but our fleet allows us to concentrate our defenders where they are attacking, as well as allowing us to bombard them from the safety of the skies. If we lose our armada, our hopes fade dramatically. Meet us there when I can, when you can. Look, those Nerubians are fleeing. Not fleeing, advancing. They mean to destroy our air docks. Yeah, that's what me and Reyna were just discussing, and he was discussing the reason that Numura gave for it. So yeah, we were we were just discussing that. I've only played the first Kingdom Hearts. My faith. I'm glad you're with us. Without our airships, we have little chance of holding back the Nerubians in the long run. To say nothing of our uh, dock workers who are safe below deck. Let's see to the defense. In my heart. If we're going to hold the Nerubians back, we have to deal with their siege weapons. Around 10 years assault or ascent. There are kegs of black powder to supply our ships for combat. Since the Nerubians have caught these ships on the ground, let's put that powder to work. Gather some barrels and take them down to the Nerubian siege weapon. If you are lost in darkness, you uh, are well, it is on the list of games in the Square Marathon. I think like Kingdom Hearts One is guaranteed, and then like the other stuff is like incentives. I am eager to hear your story. For their eyes only. We fought the Nubians since we arrived. Their attacks have not risen to this level in a long time. These airship docks are clearly a target, but do they have any others? Is there a larger goal? The Nerubians carry shade casters with orders from their queen. We need to learn what we can of their plans and intentions, and recovering a few of these, of those shade casters, is the best way we can do so. Uh, well, I, I plan on starting the marathon on the 1st of September. Cairo, the Dawn Tower isn't lit. If Belladar should shift, which is why I'm, I'm going to try to get this thing. No, 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 we don't disband. We, ignite the we don't disband. Train. Well, the start date is like, so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get all leveled up in WoW. Um, then we, then, like, sub ten, like, I, I believe Twitch is doing a September this year, hopefully. But with September, that'll be, like, September will be the start day. And then the beginning, like September first, is the is the plan start day, which is why I asked Nick if we could take this Saturday off of Minecraft, so I could do one more, one last speed run attempt day of FF7 before we jump into casual Square Enix Marathon, uh, Square Marathon um, mode. Five twenty-eight. Is that better than what I have? I have a five twenty-two, but I have a four set, so it's gonna take a lot more than that to make me replace. Um, I I have a Google Doc. I don't believe it's public. I could probably show you. Thirty percent off new subs. What about gifted subs? Is it is it bollocks for gifted subs? Because that's a uh... five or more. Okay. Well. Okay. So still gifted subs apply.
I don't know if you guys can see this, but I'll, I'll send you guys the schedule. As, as some of my mods, you guys should, should know the schedule idea. Still subject to, to finalization, but that's kind of the idea we have going on right now. There's a skywriting glyph somewhere. Let me find it. Let's see. Okay. Well, well request that. We'll see. So we'll see if Tasha approves or not. I know she's been a little busy this last week, so. Let's see, where the fuck would, if I was a skywriting glue, where would I be? I grabbed the one that's over there, so it's gotta be, oh, there it is. Found it. Yeah. Did you say something in your request? Did you, were you were you a dumbass in your request? Oh Jesus! Well, she she'll know that it was meant for me anyway. If you said something silly, my goodness. Huh. This is why we can't have nice things, Reno. This is why we can't have nice things. In all our history together, have you ever seen me make a Google Doc? Okay. Y'all, you played yourself. Well, the only one who will get in trouble is me anyway, Reyno, so you have nothing to fear. Siege weapon destroyed, okay. They have nobody manning their siege weapons. Well, th th this is the freest destruction of siege weapons I've ever seen. I guess they must not be that important. You know, this is kind of like the, the, the episode of Game of Thrones where they put their catapults outside the safety of their, uh, of their castle walls, you know? Brilliant. Brilliant tactic. I will always try. We have lost Final so War? Many. Ascension? Not as many a answers as questions, but we at least have some pieces of the puzzle. Will I be forgiven? I hear a radiant With those siege weapons destroyed, we're in much better shape. Farron went ahead to, the, to light the Dawn Tower with Great... with Great Chiron. They're just gonna call him Great Chiron? Pompous motherfuck. She asked that we meet them there. We have lost so many. Siege Lord Zeraj. The Nerubians all seem to be taking orders from that Siege Lord south of here. If you can defeat if we can defeat her, that may turn the tide of this attack. How do they know their genders? I wouldn't like looking at that like um uh yeah, definitely a female. Anyway, 
Without a leader organizing the attack, the Arathi may be able to drive back to Nerubians, especially if Farron is able to light this Dawn Tower she spoke of. But the longer we delay, the greater damage to the Arathi airships. Go, quickly! Will I be forgiven? Flip a coin, you know what? That's not a bad, uh... Statistically speaking, you would, you would be, uh... It would be a pretty solid strategy. I'm not getting any, like, herbalism levels for gathering these. Good to see you, champion. Hello. I've been tracking this one since it crawled up out of its hole. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure you have. <laughs> I look at these Arathi and see my son. I will slaughter every new. Hey, Illyria, what's up, baby girl? What's going on, baby girl? I'm glad to have her back. Alright. I will help if I can. With the Nerubian leader defeated, we should be able to leave the defenses to the Arathi. You saved many lives today. I thought we agreed you'd stay in Dornagor. I heard stories of the Arathi. As king. I mean, I was curious. Dude, she looks like she's got the uh oh boy. She has just got the resident I'm pissed off face. Well, Look at that. Like she is just mad, dude. She is just mad. Farron went to light the Dawn Tower. She said it keeps the light of the sacred flame shining upon Hallowfall. Chiron is there as well. It's hard to imagine that any beacon could outshine their star Belladar. But I'm eager to see this new expression of the light. Meet me by the Dawn Tower and we can see how the sacred flame of the Arathi helps to safeguard these long lost cousins of mine. I hear a radiant song. Treasure. 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 Break down the sapphire. Okay. Stunning sapphire. Uh-oh. I'm in a really tiny space here. Okay, there we go. Mounts some... I couldn't mount some of my mounts. We skadoosh. Am I needed? All right. Farron, Farron says these Dawn Towers with the Lamplighter's aid keep the Arathi ready for whatever darkness comes. Do I feel ready? Oh, I'm oh, ready. Between the light and the voice. That would be called the void, Dune sweetheart. The towers hold back the darkness with the sacred flame. But the light always returns. What up? Hey, thanks, Jesse, for the two gifted subs. Sacred Appreciate you, man. Thank you for the support. How you doing, man? And they. Inevitably, the void consumes everything. Show yourself, monster! <laughs> nice, dude, nice. You know where to find me. Deeper in the darkness. They're doing a good job with Zalatath, I'll say. She... So far, so good on... On the storytelling aspect. I will scout ahead. 
Be careful, Lyria. Um, it's no long. But wait, didn't it just shift to darkness? Oh, there we go. Watch the outsiders. There it goes. There it goes. <laughs> the fucking eyebrows. Yeah. Cannot hide from evil. Just in time, Belar has fallen dark for a time, but now we have our own light to hold back the darkness. Be strong. My darkness friend. has fallen. We can't rest yet. The light from the tower will hold the worst dangers in the darkness at bay. It's my duty as a lamplighter to keep all my ta all the towers blazing. My patrol takes me to Laurel's Crossing by air next. I would welcome you and Anduin at my side for all our sakes. Despite everything. This darkness, how long does it last? Sometimes only moments, sometimes days. We lost so many the first time it turned. We will travel by air. Monsters arise in the darkness. I am enjoying the more the the more storytelling emphasis so far of the war within. Lots of cutscenes that didn't exist before. How do you do it? When night falls, the army enacts the shadow curfew. Get inside, get to safety. Oh, oh incoming. I'm... Use the lances on those enemies. Lance of Longinus. Good work. You'd fit in well with us lamplighters. As I've, our numbers yeah. dwindle, some find their faith shaken. They turn to the whispers in the darkness. Look out! Here come more of those fiends. I got to I got to check my what what, what the build I'm doing here. A behemoth! Quickly, take it down! Thank goodness. That was a small one. But those monsters can take out a warship. We must hold to our faith in the sacred flame. Ourselves. And in each other if we are to succeed. to their aid. Seek shelter immediately. what I've been following. Yeah. Okay. Reaper's Mark deals 10% increased damage and exterminate and power the initial marrow. What the hell is exterminate? What is exterminate? Do I have an ability I haven't been using? Reavers might increase damage and exterminate and I don't know what exterminate is. I have nothing called exterminate except for the thing... Except for the... Hold on. I have... I, there's nothing that says anything about exterminate. A blood plague deals as damage in half the duration of the second scythe of exterminate. Uh, so what's exterminate? What? What's... Uh, uh. Oh, it's the final ability. Okay. 
All right. I'm, that, that helps. Okay. I'm like, Relative where is exterminate? Here. Secure the village, then rescue the captives. They'll be dead by then. A lamplighter brings. I don't care if Steel Strike thinks I'm reckless. I don't care if I get hurt. I can't let my people die. We've lost too many already. To Nerubians, to Kobus, to the Shadows themselves. There's hardly any of us left. How long until there are none? I need to know more about the Kobus. Horrible, violent, and stinky creatures. Stinky creatures? They, they plagued us since the moment we've arrived in Hellafall. We've tried to figure out how intelligent they are. Could we parlay for peace? But every scholar we've sent to study how to communicate with them has ended up dead. Usually dead and eaten. And worse, they seem to wield some kind of necromancy. As if eating us wasn't enough, sometimes they choose to dishonor the memory of our allies even further by raising them to fight against us. I have no idea how they choose which of us to eat and which of us to raise. Raise the strongest, eat the plumpest? It turns my stomach to contemplate these things. Yeah, I, 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 I did. I got like maybe six or seven golds. Don't give in to fear. I did do a step up. Yeah, I, I might do another if I get the crystal. All right. Cobus lurk in the shallows of murky water and snatch any who come near faster than a viper, and that's just when they hunt alone. In numbers, they are a swarm to be reckoned with. They've been a plague on the outskirt villages since the day we arrived. They eat victims alive, given the chance. We must rescue the villagers that have already been dragged to the water. Be strong, my friend. Judging by the glint in your eye, you wish to join Farron in this madness. To push into the Cobus waters in the darkness? You are a fool with a death wish. Well, I am a death knight. Take as many of those damnable fish out as you can before they drag you into the depths for their dinner. We lose so many to the darkness. Soldiers, with me! Here we go. Not with the light, but I know first aid. Anduin's fighting his ability to use the light. Oh, look at these motherfuckers. These, so these are new people. The Cobus. They're fish people. More more fish people than than Murlocs. These these are more like humanoid fish people. All right. Gasping plea. A gasping, pathetic-looking fish taken from the corpse of a cobus flops weakly in your hand. Its beady eye twitches, and you suddenly hear a breathless voice in the recesses of your mind. The water. Take me to the water. Away from these cobus wretches. Away from the sky. Put the strange fish in safe waters near the cobus camp. I don't know, man. That's a talking fish. I mean, is this Nazoth again? What do we got over here? Loot lost cash. Need to be closer to interact with it. I'm right on top of it. There we go. Disobedient be slave release. Okay, these this is a bonus objective. Okay, we'll do that.
Just gather these herbs. Could be, yeah, for real. It really depends on what you need. Like, is is the stuff that you're missing in the draw or not? Like, for me, my biggest thing is I'm waiting. I, I know I need to finish Tifa's mountain gloves, but I only have, like, two to get. So if they, if they re-put up that banner with Tifa's, like, mountain gloves, I'll probably be fine. Like if, if they keep it like unless they if they keep like leaving some of these as exclusives like to only the events like the FF9 uh, gear because I wasn't even able to get um, Cloud's uh, FF9 weapon to to the purple or what we call it, pink tier it's still like I think it's four star red or five star red despite doing like. 30k worth of draws on the FF9 one. Yeah. Right, well I did just spend the Tifa fragments I had on on another one. So yeah, that's the, the here's the weird thing, dude. The 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 fragments they offer are not balanced. Like I haven't really spent Tifa fragments until just like now. And I only had like 90 in reserve, where some of the other characters have like, like they just recently had an event that actually had Tifa fragments, and that's why I spent them. But other characters, I've had over like 300, almost 400 fragments of that character. Yeah, like yeah, that was it. Like Tifa was on Behemoth, and that was it. Like that's the only time I've really gotten fragments for her. Whereas I've got like, I had like over 400 Barrett fragments and like a bunch of red fragments, for example. It's like they, they know which characters are the most popular. So they try to coax people into the other characters with that stuff, I guess. That's how it feels anyway. And I really kind of need them to redo Cloud's samurai garb. Like, I'm really missing that samurai, um, armor for him. Like, th th that's like a huge DPS loss I have on him, his entire build. Okay, this guy's gonna throw down light that I need to catch. Haste verse belt. Yeah. All right. First piece of gear being replaced. There we go. Bada bing, bada boom. That's the first new piece of gear. 
fine. Punches, punches, lucky goos and root. Farewell, friend of the grummels. Sell all my junk. Where's the fish? How am I? Oh. Here you go, fish. Bro, that's like Nazoth fish. The fish gulps down salt water to regain its breath and turns to look at you with, an, with intellect, intelligent eyes. I live, thanks to you. The shade of these rocks suits me nicely for the work to be done. Allow me to repay your selfless gesture. A sharp intelligence in the fish eyes betrays the idea that it is in any way ordinary. When the, speak, when the fish speaks, its lips do not move. You hear its voice in your head. No doubt you have found that your senses cannot be trusted when dealing with the Cobus. A tremendous power, is it not? It is only fair that you show them the power they wield is not theirs alone. I will show you how to craft a tool to lure and destroy them. You will find their kind to carry shards taken from the deep. Bring them to me. To deceive the senses of these Kobus is one matter. To know what will captivate them is another. They champ they champ and drool at the thought of is that chomp and drool? Champ and drool? At the thought of devouring your kind, but it is the voice of the deep that transfix them and lower their guard. It's then yet you will strike. Search their shrines to gain an insight for what these wretches hold sacred. See how they have twisted the bellowing truths that lie below. They are gone, but their blood remains. The blood remembers. Swim in these dark waters and be changed by them. No light shines in these depths. Yeah, we definitely are dealing with the Zoth fish. Dark blood rains from the false sky. It tastes of wars past and wars to come. The false sky. Bring the materials. Only then can we continue. 
Glinting abyssal shards and the strands of coral, bound with words of power and worn around the neck. I will show you how to trick the senses of your enemy. You see now what the Cobus revere. It is time to put that dark knowledge to use. Alluring offer. It is done. Take this tidal charm, cloak your form in the darkness of the sea, and unmake the Cobus. Their strongest warriors gather and scheme against your kind upon that central island. With the lure, they will not see you for what you are. Use that advantage to become their end. But understand, as the Cobus failed to, this is a power you borrow. It belongs to the sea. Use the beguiling lure optional. I don't even know where it is. It's not in the... Uh... Okay. Sunless Tide Marshals. Dab. You know, I'll bet that one shot them before the change. As it as it kind of like the idea would be it should one shot them. Stab. I almost feel like it'd be quicker if I didn't. Like just, just gather the three here. See what you did, Blizzard? You took out... You made it so I didn't even want to use your cloak thing because of your stupid change. Well done. Chieftain Gill Carver. Gather this up here. <laughs> this reminds me of that one owl mount from Ark that was so much fun to ride. Another skywriting glyph in the area. There it is. With this, the lesson has been given. They will think twice before considering my kind as meat. You will you kill well, Landwalker, but the power of the deep must be returned. Our time together nears its end. I remain weakened by my time so near the searing light of the surface. I ask that you take me deeper to the waters, away from these cobis, where I can return to my kind. Come here, fish. And do we do you drop them in deeper waters? go fish a warbling cry emanates from the fish it casts its song into the ocean depths 
I expected an ignoble end at the hands of the Kovas for my folly. Never could I have believed the Land Dweller would be my savior. I will remember you. Now, let the facade be at its end. My kind will be expecting me. The fish form begins to shift and unwind. You realize this guy's the fish has been yet another illusion. Yeah. Yeah. Our cooperation is at an end. Now I return to the sea beneath the sea, away from this accursed star. Bring its light to our depths and we shall be your crushing end. Let us not meet again. The thought of it, your drowned corpse displeases me. Interesting. Interesting. Well, we knew he was a void. Like, it's basically Nazoth fish, but yeah, interesting. Dude, there's so many quests. Holy shit, dude. There's no way. Yeah. I ain't getting to all those. And do it. You have our thanks, Farron Lothar. And you too, outsiders. Farron Lothar? 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 Who is calling for Thank help? you. These people are badly hurt, but I think they will make it. Some seem to have some skill in healing of their own. We have lost so many. These foes are relentless. I hear a radiant song. I will see you through. I don't the care if Steel Strike thinks I'm. Oh yeah, we already, we already read that. I trust in your strength. I must ask you to go ahead to reinforce Cena's yearning. And when I can see my people to safety in Laurel's Crossing, with the darkness in the Cobus, the hearts of my people in Cena's yearning will be faltering to fear. We can't let them wallow. Light a torch with the sacred flame in the center of town and use it to inspire my people's valor. Remind them of their strength. We will catch up with you. May the flame guide you, my friend. Don't give in to fear. If more of those fishy bastards try to... Uh, my leg, I can't... Violence! Violence! Easy. We'll patch you up. Friend, go assist the general in Cena's yearning. We'll meet you there. He chose violence. Oh. oh, stay a while and listen. Let's go, dude. I will help if I can. Did I hear that right earlier? You're a uh, Lothar? You know the name? Yeah. Know it. I was named for Anduin Lothar. Darkness. Man, that stupid the names fish hold higher esteem. You must be a lady, or... A... Oh no, don't you start using formalities on me. My family is noble, but it's been long since we've seen great fortune. To think I had relatives in the old world. Wonderful. I hope I can live up to such legends. Wait, if your grandfather was king of this... Stormwind, then... Anduin, my new friend. Are you a king? I was a king. Not anymore. No. So, don't you start using formalities on me either. Once a king, always a king. Okay, now. What can I do? Does it do the same? Did it, I hear that right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I was just double checking. It's the same. Stay a while and listen. I just so want to know. You live. It's fair and well. Yes. You seem um. General Steel Strike, you seem a little annoyed that I lived. Hmm? Did I hear a little hesitation in your voice? Hmm? Maybe a little. This land. Are you, a, are you a are you a traitor? Maybe. So you outsiders and Farron managed to both survive and save the villagers at the beach. We're in trouble here. The Cobus brought some of their strongest forces to the doorstep of villagers of the villagers. We have our hands full just holding the line. If you can take out the mo those monsters, we might be able to turn the tide. Caution. The Arathi will fight so long as the light is with us. Well, I don't know. You seem you seemed a little surprised. Arathi groups rallied. Okay. Rally, motherfuckers!
Tide Lord Teeth Wretch. to me. Rally to me. The abominable wave crash. The abominable, abominable wave crash. Rally. Deeps. Dude, was Deep Sledger just smacking a pillar? Like, what are you doing, buddy? You do you, you training? You doing a training dummy hit? What are you doing? Rally. You're all right, Fairy. Now stop and take a breath for once. Okay, she might not be a traitor. She just... I will always try. Will I be forgiven? All right. Every Arathi has killed more Cobus than I care to count. We've also lost more Arathi to Cobus than I want to count. I don't know what underwater cavern they hail from, but I shudder to think of it. The day of darkness changed everything. A beacon in the Arathi are strong, proud. The Cobus may be vile, but they will not win this day. Do I want the lit torch or the unlit torch? I mean, we go with the lit torch. If you are lost in darkness, a wave of shadow. What just happened? Oh, uh, well, that was pretty bad. To the unknown in my heart Farron's wide eyes dart around in surprise what just happened did you see that shadow and the oil well it's gone dark I've never seen anything like this before could it be nearby the could it be the nearby dawn tower hurry you are lost in darkness we those shadows came from the dawn tower Farron wait we must withdraw to Merelda. Never give up, never surrender. Need to choose a, oh, a special. Specialization. Yeah, the tower. My faith kindles. Look closer to the tower with Farron and Anduin. We kept the dawn tower. What is happening to it? <sighs> Illyria's kicking butt is what happened. In Alric, she's. <gasps> The Harbinger has whispered to me of your arrival. A and your can... failure at Dalaran. Where is your master? <laughs> no! The Sacred Flame! 
What has Alric and his cults done? I don't know. But they claim allegiance to Zalatath, and so their lives are forfeit. My arrow The fear and shame of these people lingers in the air like a fog. I do not make This Order of Night, as they call themselves, did some foul ritual to turn the tower's flame to darkness. I know not what. We should investigate. They will not escape. The flame is corrupted. Can we restore it? Anduin, it's your time to shine, buddy. This is your this is something you gotta do. This shadow it's too much. Alaris is like Anduin, yeah. Help her. Call upon the light once more. I No, I can't. There must be another way. There is no other way, Anduin. You must call upon the light! I will help if I can. I should have. I I can almost taste it, the light. It's right there at the tip of my fingers, but I just can't reach we have for lost it. So many. What have you learned? Stay sharp. Something evil happened she here. Hide from me. When shadow falls, lamplight is rise. So much darkness. How could it come to this? Does light give way to darkness so easily? Tell me about Elric. Elric was one of us, a lamplighter. For years, he worked with us to keep the Dawn Towers lit and the people of Hollowfall safe. We all trusted him. He'd fought with us. We'd saved people from the darkness together. Then he betrayed the Arathi and everything the lamplighters stand for. He ambushes, ambushed my friend Andari and leads the Order of Night, who caused the breach here and all these deaths. I'm still not sure what has he, what was he ever good? Did he plan that from the start? I don't know any more, anyone more terrible. No one even comes close. Uh, I mean, uh, I don't know. Uh, let me, let's sit down and stay a while and listen. I'll tell you about the Lich King and all this shit, you know, someday. God damn. The wounds on the body form a ritualistic pattern. This poor soul was not only killed, but sacrificed to the darkness. The pole arm has faint sigils carved into the, the, sh the haft. They have been torn and changed, forming new shapes. They pulse with dark energy. My friends, we have lived in fear long enough. Beladar has been trying to show us the way. The light has forsaken us. The lights of glare are all watched, exposed. In the darkness, we are free. We are afraid of the dark only because the light wants us to be. Beladar has shown us the way. No more fear. Instead, we must become fear. Elric lead. The journal is heavily scratched out and torn up. Few segments remain. Tabitha, I'm leaving. I'm tired. I don't expect you to understand. The Order of Night gathers strength. They hide in caves and towns and linger with our greatest enemies. They even have a base beneath one of their precious towers. The army has no idea. The light has made us all blind. Not me. Not anymore. What have we fought for this whole time? Why are we here? Does Beladar even know we exist? Does its love for us... Does its love... Does it love us for our devotion, or does it hate us for holding it back? What if its true form is darkness? 
We've told in the light for years. What good has it done? We die, picked off in the shadows one by one. Perhaps we should listen to what Belladar is trying to tell us. There's comfort in the shadows. I'm tired, Tabitha. I know what this means. I know we will end up hurting our own, hurting you. I'm not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. We owe our service to those in need. A cave. Could they still be nearby, continuing to corrupt the flame? We are a light in the darkness. So they killed a kite, Kelther too. Theron squeezes her eyes shut and mouths a prayer and a curse at the same time. We'll make sure he gets a proper funeral. The Order of Night will pay for this. We sealed off Gloomcrag, the nearby cave, years ago. They must have dug their way in so they could target this Dawn Tower. How long have they been planning this? How long has the Order of Night been among us, our ranks? Don't give in to fear. When I reached for the flame, I felt the overwhelming hopelessness and despair that had been poured into it. It pains me, but... My light alone is not enough to banish these shadows, and so we take a more direct path. If the remaining cultists have withdrawn to Gloomcrag Bower, their combined power must be what's keeping the flame dark. We must stop them before the darkness spreads. Despite everything. Look out! What are those things? They hardly seem real. A trick of the shadow. I will deal with them. You all go ahead. All right, I'm going ahead. Feel the terror of the dark. Joke's on you. I haven't been afraid of the dark since I was like 15. It all grows dim. You will know my fear. The Harbinger commands. You will know my fear. The shawl is darkness. This is awkward. Okay. Quickly, friend. Alric is nowhere to be found. Yeah, until your light, your but eyes adjust. Yeah. Are building powerful darkness up ahead. We cannot hide from evil. They made their choice. Be strong, my friend. Farron speaks in a hushed, furious whisper. Good work, but before we can leave, there's something else. Down this way are some powerful priests. I think they are summoning something. Something big. No doubt to strike at us above and drive us from the tower itself. It will be dangerous, but we must stop them. Are you with me? If you are if we stop that ritual, I should be able to cleanse the flame. Yeah, let me just grab this herb really quick first. Okay, now I'm ready. Oh, okay. Light be my... Come on, you can do it, Anduin. Stand strong. The darkness won't take us today. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. I mean, there could be something really bad down there, you know? You never know. Ah! Ah! Ow! 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 Ah! Anduin, you're light. Anduin, heal me! What happened to it? Anduin! Anduin! God damn it. It doesn't matter. I'm no longer worthy of it. All right, that's my first war within death. I wasn't expecting the uh, just the compounding damage of all those swirls. Especially when nothing so far has even hurt me. So that was just a little unexpected. I will always try. We have to get out. There must be a way. It's suffocating in here. Are we running out of air? We have to... We have to get out. All right, claustrophobic Anduin. Baron's eyes are dark with weariness. It never ends, does it? Don't give in to... I've never seen shadows this deep, this vicious. It almost feels like they're reaching for us. Baron shudders. We can't stay here. We carry the flame into the... More shadows. We're trapped in here, aren't we? No. We're not giving up here. Let's go. We can do this if we stick together. Come on, Anduin. You'll get the light back. What if it goes out? What if you failed your people? You think I've never failed? <laughs> I've never made mistakes? Oh boy, a kid is gonna lecture Anduin Rin, the fucking king of Stormwind. Supposed to be in Halifon. I stowed away to escape a family that only ever saw me as a failure. Was it a mistake? I lost an eye and an arm for it. Does that make me unworthy of the light? I regret nothing. I keep fighting because in the darkness, it's all we can do. I can't give up. It's not in my nature. And I don't think it's in yours either. You don't understand. I've hurt people. I was controlled by darkness, but part of me enjoyed it. Enjoyed hurting people? Or no longer being able to agonize over every thought and action? Thank you for the hydrate user one. I'll have to go grab some water from downstairs. Having doubt, making mistakes, none of these make you unworthy, Anduin. They light your path forward. All right, Anduin, it's time to use your light to get us out of here, buddy. The entrance. It's gone. There really is no way out. Enough of your illusion, Salata. Or Illyria is going to get us out of here. Belador's light has returned. Thank you, Illyria. Yeah, what were you saying, Anduin? You being a little Debbie Downer, hmm? Little, little, little Downer of the Debs? Little Deb Deb Downy Doo? I am on the hunt. I'm glad you're safe. I sensed something amiss when those creatures suddenly stopped attacking. I stopped attacking the tower and disappeared. Belladar shifted on its own shortly after. That was that was no sim that was no simple illusion. Zalatath trapped you in. I wonder was I its intended target? You, me, Anduin, Farron, perhaps she was happy to ensnare any of us. I will not fail again. A lamplighter brings Do you hope. feel it? Hope returning? Thank you for your help. The Dawn Tower's flame remains dark, but this time I think we'll be able to restore it. Let's meet at the tower. A beacon in the dark. Illyria, we would have been lost without you. Thank you. I'm glad you're all safe. 
Let's end this. To those I am ready. Join me, please. <sighs> you know the light is not with me. There is no darkness so deep that the light cannot reach us. Just be here with me. Now, breathe. We are the seekers of light. We are the holders of hope. In the very heart of shadow, we are the lamps that guide the way. first step. The rest is just time and trust. It's kind of ironic because at one point like Anduin was arguably the the best user of the light in all of Warcraft like in uh, Battle for Azeroth. We are a light in the darkness. Despite everything, Farron gives a warm tired smile. Joy. Thank you. Thank the light you all arrived when you did. I'm glad we can help each other. In my heart. To Merodal. Mer Meraldar. We must get to Meraldar and let General Steel Strike know what the Order of Night tried here. Thank the Sacred Flame we stopped them before they could do any worse. Be strong, my friend. We need to return to Meraldar. I need to let the General know what happened here. This Order of Night is no mere cult. The harbinger they speak of is Zalatath. She we won't stop. Your people need to be ready. We should probably let them know. We should probably debrief them on who Zalatath is. You know, just saying a little debriefing is in order. All right. New, uh, new pants as well. I mean, let me go grab some water from downstairs so I can get that hydrate from using one done. Ill prepared. All right. Whoop. 
This zone is very pretty, though. Like, as far as zones go, this one definitely is the best. But that was to be expected. We th This one is aesthetically really well done. Where's the uh Alric corrupted the Dawn Tower's flame? Oh, Ash, yeah, take that man and this harbinger. Alright, she seems to be on the level. Okay, I need to find where that uh where the sky riding glyph is hanging out. There it is. Finally, a chance to rest. We must prepare for Belladon. You have done us a great service. I have put the army on high alert for Elric. If he moves, we'll know about it. For now, though, I think you deserve a break. The darkness comes. I have to admit, I did not we think that prepared. the first visitors we'd have in Meraldar would would have been outsiders. I thought the Empire. Well, never mind. You have been more than helpful to my people, and that deserves recognition. Meraldar is the bastion of the Arathi and Hallowfall. Take some time. Rest. We are surrounded by dangers. We should grab some food at the inn while we can. One of the general's rules I happily follow. Perhaps a moment's rest is warranted. Pretty nice for a traitor. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. I don't think she's gonna pull a sphene, but we'll see. I mean, Sphine, we, we were, I was sus of Sphine from the get-go. Like, I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry, baby girl. No fucking way. Like, that was just so sus from the get-go, man. Friend, can you order a round of drinks? Sure, why not? I can do that. Now this one looks like they have a story to tell. Purchase a round of, uh, I'll make, uh, do I want to make, yeah, you know what? I'll make this in my own. the light of the flame brighten your day. All right, purchase a round of drinks. What am I, what? A round of drinks. Literally, a, okay, literally a round of the drinks. The cats are trained as well as the soldiers are. When one bonds to you, you have a friend for life. Illyria, of course, you first. Do you have a lynx? Oh, no. No, no, no. 10 silver, bro, I'm yeah. I'm not a cat person. Not a cat person? Me either, I like dogs. Okay, then ladies second. Anduin, and then, of course, serve myself last. When shadow falls, lamp light what can you nice. tell me of the Arathi Empire? I was young when we left, but I have some memories. I remember the, par the parade through the city streets. Everyone would be out and cheering as the army walked by. I remember the lynxes in ceremonial armor, resplendent and regal. I remember the, par the park near where I used to live. My parents would take me for walks there and we'd feed the animals. Most of all though, I remember the feeling of belonging. I remember my family. I remember my friends. We carry the flame into the, the Bastion of Hollowfall. This city has much to see. Don't give in. It's been good to sit down and breathe for a bit. A beacon in the dark. You see Illyria scanning the people entering and exiting the inn. Any one of them could be an order of night member uh, an order of night member. Any one of them could have the information that I need. How are you doing? You think this is the first time I've lost friends? I've lived a long time. In the Thousand Years War, I saw planets burn. I lost my brother to the Orcish Horde in the Second War. I lost my sister to herself. Torellian and Erator, I haven't spent as much time with them as I would like. Dalaran isn't the first time I have lost people. Dalaran wasn't your fault. It was my job to stop her. Not only did I fail, but I failed so catastrophically that a city was destroyed. I mean, Dalaran's been destroyed a couple times, baby girl. It's okay. I may not have caused Dalaran's destruction, but it happened because of me. Is Verisa safe? She's safe, thank the stars. She moved away from Dalaran a few years ago. I stop by when I'm able to put my, but I'm when I'm able to, but my work keeps me busy. Much as I love my sister, she is the least of the things I need to worry about at the moment. We're here for you if you need us. Thank you. After Zira imprisoned me, 
I had given up all hope of seeing Azeroth again, of seeing my son. After you rescued us, I got to see both. And now I am deep in the battles of Azeroth with the very person who saved me from another planet. It would be nice if this ended the same way. Oh, you know, Larry, if things don't work out with Terrellian, you know? Um... I'm single! Um, player housing's probably gonna unlock during this World Soul Saga if you're looking for, uh, if you're looking for some help, I do you not know, miss. in certain things. I will not. Zalatath is using the Order of Night to serve her whims. I overheard some of the Arathi complaining about a new wave of propaganda that has been put up around Meraldar. Find what you can and deliver it to General Steelstrike. I'll be there as soon as I can. We need to convince her of the severity of this threat. She cannot hide from Mandolin. We need to talk. Of course. I need to see Rain about my prosthetics anyway. Let's meet later. Is uh, am I the first one to get up? Okay, I'm the first. Am I? The I'm the first one to get up. Okay. What can I do? Anduin looks lost in thought as he stares at his ring. What's on your mind? Anduin looks over to you. You've been so helpful down here, as always. How do you do it? How can you even look at me after what happened, after what I did to you? I tried to kill you. That wasn't you. It felt like me. I remember the rage. I remember the hate. I remember the exhilaration, satisfaction even. Were they my emotions or his? I don't know, but I felt them. In my nightmares, I still feel them. Anduin sighs. Maybe Farron's right. Maybe I need to let it go. But I never understood how. How can one just decide one day to feel better about everything? Maybe it just means to keep moving forward. What are your thoughts on the Arathi? Honestly, I'm still reeling. I didn't expect to find that there's an entire empire across the sea when I started on this journey. The Arathi Empire of our world collapsed so long ago and has dwindled down to the smallest remnant now to find that the empire continued to flourish across the sea? But still, we are dealing with such a small portion of the Arathi. Are they normally this friendly, or do we need to be worried? Well, I mean, you'd have to have paid attention to the last couple expansions to know why they're depressed. The ten years of what's been ten years? What, what, <laughs> like, so, so Anduin used to be the mo the biggest. Ch so, a little background on him: he used to be the champion of the light, basically, he's the king of Stormwind, and during battle for Azeroth during like a huge battle he called upon the light that basically healed the entire battlefield of his soldiers like he was he's he is so powerful in the light that I don't think there was anyone that could match him and then in the Shadowlands expansion he got corrupted by the jailer who nobody likes as a villain you know and um he ended up killing people doing like terrible things but we I mean we stopped him before he could do anything too bad he was like a raid one of the raid bosses of the last raid you know and he just feels guilty about the whole thing and that's why he's a little depressed he feels like he can't wield the light anymore that he betrayed everybody yada yada and he basically he's just being a little bitch he, he, like Anduin's just being a little bitch about it he needs to he needs to man the fuck up Ooh, what yeah. have you learned? Stay a while and listen. They will not escape. I wish you had heeded my warning and stayed in Dornagal. She is here, Anduin. The Arathi are in danger. We are in danger. I needed to see if there were really descendants of the Arathi down here. I'm the King of Stormwind. So many human kingdoms have fallen. I needed to know if there were others. It was still a foolish risk. You're not the only one grappling with the voices in their head. What have you been hearing? Beladar, the Emperor's vision. That prophecy that drew them here. It's the radiant song I'm hearing. You have been hearing the star? Yes. No, not really. When I saw Beladar for the first time, I had the vision again. It's related somehow. I wish Katgar were here. He'd know what it all meant. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... No. 
You're right. I wish he was here as well. We'll Dad have to Gar. find our own answers. I've gotten a look at the crystals and their key flames. It's not Azerite, but it's close enough that I think they're connected. Then you've realized when Belladar shifted for the first time. Yeah, me too. The Tiva Aerith wallpapers. That day of darkness. Ten out of ten. <laughs> the same day Sargeras plunged that sword into Azeroth. I will see you through the shadow. Carnage, meet Rain, our head armorer. She leads a team whose inventions have saved many lives since we landed in Hallfall. Rain herself forged my shield. I always enjoy coming here and seeing what new things her team has thought of. Be strong, my Baron. I was inspired last Belladar's shadow. I designed a new arm prosthetic. I think you'll wear this one. Thank you, Rain. But the shield you made me is all I need. I'm sure your talents would be better spent on other inventions. Why don't you it's see my it? pleasure to make a new arm you would use, Farron. You told me about the discomfort and how it impacted your mobility. So I was thinking... Rain? No. I have lived with my injury since I was a child. I've learned to do everything from sword fighting to dressing myself with one hand. But what if I figured out the weight balancing? You said that was what you didn't like about the first view I made. Then I think some of our veterans who will lose an arm to the Nerubians will be very grateful that you've improved their design. Rain, I've learned to navigate my life without a prosthetic. I don't want to relearn everything, but if you want to improve something of mine, a better shock absorber on the shield would be a blessing of the flame. Those Nerubians are getting bigger, and it puts all that weight on the shoulder. Oh yeah? That's a tough one. Let me sketch out some ideas and get some measurements. I think that'll be an interesting project. Thanks, Baron. Keep up your work. Everyone on the front line appreciates the new kit upgrades. Uh, speaking of kit upgrades, you got anything for me? The world calls for inspired solutions. I'll grab this armor appearance. The sacred flame tempers not just our souls, but my steel. All right. I have to tear down some propaganda. Propaganda? How, how, how am I the one who has to do this? Where's, where's the knights in this place? They're just letting this shit go down. Bran, what the fuck are you Why doing here? Just delves, Nightfall Sanctum. Oh God, the fucking Delves. Good to see you again. I've been trying to track our Zekvir friend down. These Order of Night folks might have information regarding Zekvir. Let's go to this Nightfall Sanctum and see what we can find. All right. Uh, don't do anything I wouldn't do. I'm off to check Nightfall Sanctum. Let's hope these cultists have some information on these Zekvir, on this Zekvir that threatened us. Okay, where where's the propaganda? <laughs> where where's the Nazi propaganda? We gotta take it down. There it is. Wait, d am I am I not taking it down? What the fuck? Removing. Okay, I guess I was moving like a half a second too early. There's a propaganda on the desk? That's a little sus. Under the boats? Well, okay, this one's a little less sus. Oh, 
I see an herb. Be right back. No, no. Skadoosh. Okay, we just need one more piece of propaganda. Where, where, one more, one more piece. There we go. Guys, guys, you're sitting right here. You couldn't tear this down yourselves? God damn. Meet General S Steel Strike in the barracks. Um, there. Meet Oralia, our quartermaster. I'm also proud to call her my daughter. Well, hello, Aurelia. Your daughter, eh? Hmm. I can see where she gets her good where she gets her good looks. You know what I mean? Know what I mean? <laughs> Step what are you? The light. No, the no, not taking any light. random quests. We're sticking to the story right now. I would safeguard my people. Why is your daughter the quartermaster? You suspect nepotism? Understandable. You haven't been here for long. My daughter is, without a doubt, the backbone of the Rathi army. I lead it, but she ensures it actually runs. She has a gift for organization that we desperately need. I have tried to rotate her onto the front lines as part of our reserve rotation. As is only fair, I was overruled by the Priory every time. We must right. rely on outsiders to save the Arachnid. General Steel Strike reads through the propaganda you brought her. I need to know more about this Zalatan. Our holy mission takes a toll. Economical request. The darkness I hear you've come from the surface. Did you meet the Earthen? We used to trade with them, but after the Day of Darkness, we struggled to send envoys. Those we sent never made it back. Honestly, we thought they had perished. I'm going to try reaching out again. I'd like you to write a letter and recommendation in case we've... Uh, we did something to offend them. Write a letter of recognition in Meridor. For the Empire. Okay. Sacred flame guide your I way. I can contact the trading post representative of my people. Always be prepared. Write a letter of recommendation. Right. Two Merricks. My other best bot. <laughs> the gemmiest earthen ever. <laughs> Let's see. Hmm. My two Merricks, the gemmiest earthen ever. While writing about the plight of the Arathi, you think about the best way to describe the current state. A people beset on all sides by monsters in the dark. A bunch of underground weirdos, but aren't we all my other, other best buds? Really nice people. I'm not just saying that because they're all staring at me while I write them. Okay. A people beset, uh, let's see. A, God. A people beset on all sides by monsters in the dark. You think about it best describe what the Arathi want from the Earthen. They want to reopen trade with your people. They want to give you their shinies to get your shinies. They have some crazy stuff down here. You'll want it. Seriously. Airships. You include a request to Merricks to bring the representatives of the Zen Shiri and TNW training posts as well. All that's left is to sign your name. Carter 64, Adventure Extraordinary, your best bud, Savior Az Azeroth, so many times! We must prepare for Belladar to shift. I hope this goes well. We really need the re additional the resources. Comes. Thank you. I'll send we a runner with this to the Earth, and I pray they make it back safely. And thank you for the information about training with your people. I hope they'll join you as well. So many times! For the Empire. Holy shit, she wants me to do a lot of stuff. Always be prepared. Alright. Alright. I'll gather a selection of our major trade goods before we head out for the meetup, but I could use some help in gathering some additional items. Lately, we've struggled, been struggling with collecting the best bat meat in Halifel. Could you gather some before you come to Dunel's kindness? For the Empire. Does anyone Always like wasps? We haven't been able to gather resources from this area due to hornets moving in. We just haven't been able to spare the resources from the wall to deal with them. If you can, we'd all appreciate it. The darkness comes. We there is a plant the fiber that grows in rum rum shackle, and the fangs that makes and the and the fangs that makes for an excellent rope. What? What is that? Okay. 
there is a plant fiber that grows in Rumshackle and the Fangs. That's the name of a place? Rumshackle and the Fangs? It sounds like a band! It's like, and the Rumshackle and the Fangs! Da -da 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 -da. Because of the hornets, we haven't been able to collect it in a liar long time and are running very low on our surprise. While you were in the area, could you collect some? For the Empire. Sure. I pray for the flame to show us the way. Alright. Runner, get this letter to the earth and let nothing stop you. Go, runner! Alright, she is very quick. That is a very that is a very fast runner in all that armor. I commend her. Sparta! Your skills in combat are impressive. We are rotating our next round of reserves in active duty, and they need to sharpen their skills. Well, Illyria fills me in on Zalatath. I'd appreciate it if you could help with their training. Oh, we you want me? Aralia, All right. Send runner to Farron's new elf friend. We need to talk. Farron tells me your friend wields the void. She does. I am either going to regret meeting her or thank the flame. Listen, you can't regret meeting Illyria. She is 10 out of 10 wood bang. And I'm not just saying that. Belladar shift in your favor. Come, let me learn from you. Death strike. And then use your trinket to blah, 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 blah. Nope, I don't pull my punches, you know? Gotta gotta pop all my shit. Seekers of light. I am blessed by but you won't be beaten. Well, guess what? I got a legendary fucking axe. Sacred flame guide your way, friend. Oh well, you know, another another one that is beset by hubris. I must dispatch of you quickly. I still have my extremities given how you fight, I'll consider that Outsiders a win. Outsiders are a welcome surprise. If the shadows find you. If the general oh. thinks you are good, you must be really good. Yes, really, really good. Twice the fight, twice the glory. Well, a little sneak attack, eh? You carry your torch, you light the city. Wait, can I talk to them all at We're all down here together? <laughs> oh. Stay productive in the light. Vigilant in the light. Oh, he was like, There mm. is always hope if we choose to look for it. Waka 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 waka. Alright. The Harbinger is from the Black Empire? Flames. One of the old gods? No. Something else. A survivor from the depths of time. We are far from the Empire. Our holy mission. Thank you. What they learned from you will no doubt save their lives later. The day of darkness changed everything. Stay a while and listen. Walk with me for a bit, outsider. I assume Farron has told you of how we came to this strange land. The Emperor's vision. A prophecy of light, battle, and victory. For the Arathi and the Sacred Flame. I was newly raised to my position. Being entrusted to seek out an Imperial prophecy was a great honor. Our armada braved the storming sea and its impassable tempest. I thought that final storm was sure to scuttle every airship. Instead, there was a radiant flash. The Emperor's vision, exactly as he had foreseen. The light transported us beneath the surface of Azeroth. But still under the light of this star we named Belladar. So many died as the armada crashed into the cliffs. We thought the eternal flame of Erethor snuffed out that day. Then, as we labored to rescue this stowaway child, Farron, we discovered that she had preserved embers of the flame at risk to her own life. Brave fool. Yet I'm eternally grateful that she held on to that symbol of hope. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> Years <laughs> later, there was a great rumble. We thought the cavern was going to collapse. It was the day of darkness. The first time Belladar shifted to shadow. 
We had put down roots by then. My soldiers left to make homes for themselves. They started families. Flames, help me. There are children now. I've had too many years of defending against the monsters that go bump in the night. Great Chiron and their lamplighters guided us through the darkness. But like Farron, they mistake saving for safeguarding. My people are brave and strong, but they are not all flame-blessed heroes. I know exactly how many soldiers we lose to the dark. If we play it safe, we might survive long enough for me to put my grandchildren on the front line. I welcome you, outsider. I hope your people's arrival and the Earthen's reunification means better days for Meraldar. But I fear we have just made ourselves a bigger target for the dark. We are the holders of hope. The darkness comes. We are prepared. We must rely on I still on need more time with Illyria to learn about Zalatath. What have I what I have learned is very worrying. Farron sent word that she was going to the orphanage and asked you to meet her there. She often entertains the children while she is in Meraldar. I doubt she would I don't doubt she would appreciate you doing the same. We lose so Play many with three Arathi orphans. She was the first child to call it home. She visits whenever she can. All right. Let's go to the orphanage. Okay, how how demonic do these children look? They're all half elf children, half elf children. Um, are you two related or are we just we're, we we don't we, we only have like we're only running like three models. Yep. 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 Okay, Blizzard. Okay. B billion dollar company right here only has three child models, just different shapes and sizes. Okay, four child models. We're having a discussion, a uh, discussing, a talk about if Nerubians or Kobus are scary. What do I think? Nerubians. Oh, have a shadow, buddy. Of course it's Nerubians. Anything with more than six legs is creepy. Didn't have time to make more? Too busy counting money? Who are, who are you? you? Retrieve their teddy bear? Wow, you look really strong. Would you be able to help me? My parents were killed by the mean Kobus when I came here. I left my favorite, most well-loved teddy bear behind. Could you go get it for me? Oh, say, fine. God, I'll go grab the damn teddy bear. I'll be right back. Jesus. Hero of the world, by the way. Hey, listen. Hero of the world fetching... There, there's, there's very few things more harrowing than... Fetching an orphan's teddy bear, okay? Teddy bear. Okay, Eliza. They'll go soon. You got what you needed from them. Just wait them out. Be careful in the dark. What the hell? Wait, how did you... Drat, how did you find me? Never mind, it doesn't matter. I got what I needed from you. You can go now. I have to do this next bit on my own. Wait, how'd you get here so fast? I stowed away on my mount, obviously. I have place to be, Cobus to kill. I can't be coped up in the- Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Cooped up in some orphanage. What do you want to do here? You're not going to be like those other adults, are you? Ooh, Eliza, you can't go and kill the Cobus. They are dangerous. These Cobus killed my parents and stole their, th their things. I'm going to get vengeance to kill them right back. I'll help you kill the Cobus and get your parents' items back. When the back. star shifts, get to shelter. I will make the Cobus regret ever setting foot in this la these and lands. All right, this is how serial killers are made. Okay. Bye. All right, this is how serial killers are made. 
Fine, fine, I guess I don't mind if you come help. You do actually look big and strong. One day I'll be a lamplighter. Finally, an adult that will help me achieve vengeance. Let's salt the bones of the Koba. How old is this child? Gutting the pool. The Kobus are a bit larger than I expected. I might, might, you understand, have more trouble with them than I originally anticipated. What did we learn I can't go grab a teddy bear? Kill any stupid fish faces you see. Always have a shadow. Buddy. When the Kobus killed my parents, they stole some of their most cherished things. Not me, obviously. Cherished items. While we are murdering Kobus, let's find them. Oh, oh dear God! Oh, I don't I know. Hide in the dark. This is this is this is bad. Fine, maybe you can help me with killing. Oh God! Hold on, I got I got to go grab this. Uh, oh, this uh, this herb first. Oh Jesus! <laughs> God. I'm, uh, I'm, uh, this is, I feel like I'm a bad influence. Kobus chest. That's a, that's a bag. My mom got his helmet from my, got this helmet from my grandpa. She said it would always protect her. Maybe if she was wearing it, she would still be alive. Like when oh, she put on the helmet? That's adorable. Holy shit, it's huge. Know what to do during curfew. You got it, kid. I'll, uh... Oh, yeah, this is... This is... I feel so comfortable with this. What do we got here? Boots! Ah, these are my mom's boots! They weren't anything special, though. You can hold them. It's not like I can throw a shoe at the Kobus. Okay, so I shouldn't want to put the boots on. <laughs> covered in blood and and just like smiling and like that they're just gonna, they're gonna be like I did nothing This is not my fault Dark Tide Pebble Your attacks and abilities Okay your your attacks and god damn it Lash out with the bolt of water okay I mean, it does seem to be a very militaristic society, so it's not like she's not going to become a a warrior over time anyway. This is just kind of getting the ball rolling. Flame, take you, fish face. I'm just getting her started in a controlled environment kind of way. Die, you miserable Kobus! What do we got here? Oh, here we go. What have these filthy fish faces done to my dad's sword? He always kept it sharpened. This is a disgrace. Bro, like, dude, this is, in, this is actually kind of insane. I've never... This is... I'm so glad I decided to go to the help this kid. This is great. This is the greatest quest ever. Splendid shield. Don't tell me she's gonna have the shield. Oh, you might need to carry. Okay, yeah, so you might need to carry this one. It's a big bit. 
It's a bit big. Be careful with it. It saved my dad from lots of Nerubians. All right. You're weird looking. You've killed a lot of them. I wouldn't mind if you killed more. Just saying. Jesus. Stupid Cobus. I hate them. Well done. Far more useful than those other adults who told me not to do this. But Eliza, the Cobus are dangerous. You'll die. Stupid adults thinking they know best. Are you ready to kill the big one? I'm ready to kill the big one. Don't wander off into the dark. Ah, it's time. Kill their leader, salt his bones, take his head, and laugh at his tribe as his tribe crumbles. Sharp scales, last moments are upon him, and he doesn't even realize it yet. Stupid fish face. One day I'll be a <laughs> What have I done? What have I enabled? I don't know where this uh, herb is. It's supposed to be up, but there it is. I've created female Sephiroth. <laughs> dun 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 dun. Fish face is a racial slur. I I mean, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Die, you fish-faced freak! <laughs> That's what you get for killing my parents! That's what you get for taking everything from me! <laughs> well done. Very effective killing. I know! I'm the one who did it! What are monsters mean? His skull would make a good cup, I think. Perhaps a mantle ornament? Jesus when Christ! Well, this head is quite a bit more icky than I was expecting. You can keep that. You are much more useful than I thought. You would have been. I can hide in the dark. Well, parents avenged, fish killed, more fish killed, biggest fish killed. Pretty good day. I guess I should go burn stuff. Help Eliza say goodbye in the hungry pool and help. Go burn do, stuff? Take me to my parents' home. We have things to burn. Jesus, what have I done? What have I done to this innocent little child? <laughs> Burn! This is the female Sephiroth! She's gotta burn stuff! I got some stuff from my from the house to burn in memory of my parents. Normally we burn all the effects of the dead, but they're all I have. Okay. Lighting. There you go. Stupid fish people! They took everything from me! Oh. Don't cry, little one. Any, Anyway, you can take me back to the orphanage now. There's nothing left for me here. Sweet baby Jesus. Let me take it, yeah? You know? She's gonna be like in, in, in Five expansions from now, she's gonna be on the front lines, mark my words. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, she's wearing the helmet and she's got the sword. Oh, I'm in trouble. Are you from above? Thanks, I'll make sure to put in a good word with General Steel Strike for you. I know her well. Well, I met her once. Well, I saw her in the street, but I did think about talking to her, so it's the same thing, really. Oh. Always have a shadow, buddy. Uh, Eliza, by the flame, we had the guard out looking for you. Well, I'm back now. Parents avenged, as I said I would. I'm going to bed. Eliza, poor girl. Thank you. I'm sorry about Eliza. Her loss was recent. She is quite intense. You have no fucking idea, bro. Have you seen You're a good one, before? Carnage. Killed lots of Cobus. Still, though, it feels like we didn't really kill enough. Not really. Oh, well, plenty more fish in the sea! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, dear! Should I just deal with this now? All right, play with the orphans, okay. You're weird looking. We're looking for a big grown-up to pretend to be a monster. Can we slay you? I can One play. Day, I'll be a lamplighter. Scary roar! 
I'll kill you until you die from it. Die from what? Killing me? Haha! Roar! We're not scared of you, monster. Scared monster? Oh, we are too scary even for the monster. That was lots of fun. Okay, I, I'm. I think they're all a little nuts. Okay, you. You look like a, a normal young little lad. We're playing hide and seek. One of us is hiding. I need to find them. Yes, I want to play Only hide and seek. Only play when it's day, because at night monsters fight. Mm -hmm. Tree, the tree, this tree, this tree, in the house. Nope, not in the house. Um, uh, um, bro, where, where the fuck is the fucking the fucking kid in the damn tree? It it, it says hundred percent. Found him. Wow, you're pretty good at hide and seek. We are rating at uh at, at the Eva fourteen time yet. Yeah. You, you just, I don't know if you did the quest, Tasha. You just missed the, what do you mean, round, replacing Rauna and Seshi? What the fuck are they, what are they up to now? They won't be there. Did they say that? Hold on. I'll ping him and see what's up. There, to be fair, there were a lot of messages, so I just couldn't skim through them all. Yeah. What? You said... Oh. Okay. Yeah, you missed, like, the most psychotic little orphan kids quest. It was great. Linlin, -lin, yeah, Linlin's -lin's gonna be a little late. That's okay. That's fine. My faith kindled Welcome my to our hope. orphanage. When we arrived, I was the only child. They founded this for me. I'm not quite sure how Siegfried put up with me. I was quite rambunctious. I love coming here. When I'm in town, despite everything, the kids are so bright and happy. They are our future and we fight for them. Meraldar's light. Despite everything, I love coming here whenever I visit Meraldar. The kids always bring a smile to my face, and I hope I do to them as well. After everything they have been through, they deserve happiness. In my heart, that's the warning bells of the main gate. Children, inside! Warning bells. What do you mean one of my kids is fighting for me? What do you mean? We owe our service to those in the need. bell tolls. Those bells mean Meraldar is under attack. Let's go to let's go let's get to the gates and find out what is going on. If you are lost in darkness, Meraldar's under attack. Oh yeah, she'd find yeah, yeah, yeah. Children, stay inside. Alright, here we go. Let's see what's going on. Little demon child is already murdered. <laughs> yeah. The Cobus strike our veneration grounds during Belladar's light. The How? fuck is this wow shit? Look, General. Darkfire. This is Auric's doing. We cannot hide from evil. Elric is behind this. I, I can feel it. Whatever his plan is, we need to stop it. Algia? Oh, out Al wait. What is Algia? I love I love Pally, it's fine. I just said I'm not swapping until next year. Oh, okay. Oh. 
Wait, you can just spam the uh, alliance raids? I mean, but it's still swapping the, the class. Oh, okay. The bell tolls. In my heart. We will make them pay for this. Fire. We will hit them so hard they never come back. Despite everything, the Orathi find joy. The light of the flame, the Kobus have never attacked in such numbers before. We need to push them back and we need to stop whatever it is they are doing to the eternal flame. The darkness comes. We need to take we the veneration prepared. grounds back from the Kobus. Push them back and pave a bloody path through them. We need to stop whatever is happening at the Eternal Flame. If they manage to corrupt it like they did at the Tower, I don't even want to imagine what will happen. We lose so many to the darkness. My arrow strike true. I play 14. I, I play it all. I play, I play everything. I can sense three beacons of void ahead, all funneling their power into one massive font of darkness. You will need to kill them with them dead, I can bring down the shield. I do not miss. Arathi, push My back season the three pat Make them regret ever stepping onto our hands. I got land. one of them done, I think. I got another to go. Like, you know. It takes it takes time. Jesus. Jesus. Getting getting the guff today. Getting the guff today. All right, here we go. Oh, we we had like never done that, Alexander. Like it was the first time I ever tanked that, Alexander. I mean, I saw that my that main tank, and I had like an AOE to avoid. Like it was just like his normal attacks did an AOE around him. I didn't know what the uh, the off tank. What do you mean the bitch tank roll? Like usually the off tank is the bitch tank roll with nothing to do. the change to leveling blizzard really enjoying it look rauna rauna needs a needs checking like i've learned that from wow he did like you got to stay on top of him he is rauna rauna's rauna needs to be kept on top of it. But it, is, it was nice to see that Alouette could make such a quick change from doing like 80 glares to 120 glares. That was nice. You know? And you know, we, we got the boss down on the last pole of the night. And that, that was that was really nice. Like that that kinda of, and that was a really nice pull too. I don't think anybody I don't think we had even a simp stack, did we? Like was that a pretty the flawless pull for us? Manipulates the Kobus through their hunger and the Arathi through their fear. One stack, okay. Yeah, yeah. I think it was pretty, pretty solid.
Join me in the shadows. Bring the Harbinger joy. I mean, I was cycling my mitts a lot, but a lot of it was saving it for a rainy day, like if I'm actually getting low, because the healing was just a little inconsistent for a while. Oh, for healers, yeah, yeah, yeah. Albrecht's ritual is the source of this dark. I mean, it goes back to, to my, 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 I, my, one of my grievances he with Seshi. From the she doesn't like organizing so healing do stuff with the other healer. They just wing it the entire time. And I, it, that drives me nuts. It really does. Like, like, step by step, while we're, you know, getting our mitigation rotations down and stuff like that, she should be going, okay, you use that there, you use this here. It just, it just feels like that doesn't happen. I mean, it's not micromanaging everyone, it's your healing partner. You know? And it's your healing partner that this is their first time raiding. <laughs> you know? Like, it's, it's, I don't feel it's micromanaging, you know? Yeah. Yeah, like, I, I don't think it's, it's, I don't think it's unreasonable to ask, ask Seshi to organize healing shit with Alu. I really don't think it's unreasonable. It's, I don't know, dude. It, it's so, it's, it's one of the most annoying survive. things about having her in, in that we role. Surrounded by now dangerous. we just need to deal with the shield. We must rely on outsiders to save the Arachnid. Excellent. Now to break through the shield. She okay. Hide from me. All right. I got to, let's see. We'll, yeah, exterminate, exterminate. I search each day for a, a candle in touch. the dark. Beladar has turned to the shadow. We must retreat back to Meraldar. Belizia looks towards Elric lead. I know we need to destroy Elric first. Take him down, then we retreat. Caution is warranted. All right, Illyria. We Let's do this, baby girl. Summit. Bring down the bubble. Elric thinks the shadows will save him. He should see what true power looks like. Yes, baby girl. Show me. Taken an interest in. Do not forsake me. You have been forsaken, bitch. How, how could any Arathi be in league with such monsters? The sacred flame is lost. Fall back. No, we cannot keep retreating from the darkness. Our fear has overshadowed our faith. Belladar may have guided us, but it is not what will save us. Stand with me against the shadow. Show this harbinger the true strength of the Arathi. And if you fall against the darkness, what will we do then? And do it. Let's go, buddy. Though. It's light time. The light will return. Even if someone else carries the torch. We are the seekers of light. We are 
are the holders of hope in the very heart of shadow. Together, we guide the way. Well, that was well, down. Easy enough, no problem. No problemo. Good job. I will see you through By the, the flame, that was close. I'm glad it worked. I mean, of course it worked. I knew it would. Don't tell the general I Be said strong, that. strong, my friend. The shadow always tries to corrupt. It only works on the weak will. I will not fail again. May the light bless Farron. I thought the eternal flame lost. I thought this was the end of hope and the death of our people. The darkness comes. Our veneration Not grounds prepared. have been desecrated. It's beauty marred. It's going to take a bigger effort, but I would appreciate anything you can do to clean up our grounds. The day of darkness changed everything. Don't give in That was fear. too close. This attack took a toll on all of us. We have many injured and many shaken. Can you check in with people, see how they are doing? Carry the flame into the unknown. This land was not- How are you expected. doing? When I saw the depths of Alric's betrayal, I lost hope. I retreated. Flames! The Cobus would have taken Meraldar. We are a light in the dark. Stay a while and listen. Valyria, what happened? For years I've held back the void within me, worried I'd hurt my loved ones. When Dalaran fell, I didn't draw on my power, and someone dear to me paid the price. Like Alric, Zalatath thinks herself safe behind layers of shadow. She isn't. Not when I can turn their own power against her. I will do all it takes to end her threat for good. All right. Anduin, buddy, how's it going, man? By the light, that was incredible. I've never seen like it. The closest was Kalia's resurrection, but that, so many people, one purpose, one unity, one hope. We How are you doing? Theron said, it got me thinking. Perhaps I've been wrong about what the light wants from me. All right. Um, uh, um, uh, uh, um, are you fish people supposed to be here? Oh, the little girl is here. Look at all the dead fish people. Um, why? What? Well, I'm pretty sure something fucked up here. These guys aren't supposed to be standing. Probably. Like, you know, they're the bad guys. All right, let me clean up the grounds. I gotta pick up the spear. Clean up this. You know. I guess disposing of the bodies isn't cleaning up, though. I don't, I wouldn't, I would, I don't know if you could ever say the light is just as bad as the void. I think that's a bit of a stretch. We burn brightly together. By the flame, that was close. If those Kobus had broken through to Meraldar, who knows what would have happened. You held the line. shine on you. We are the Empire's might. We are the wall. I am the wall. It, it's a bit of a stretch. Like, the light has never sought like this kind of destruction and overall corruption you know like they're not they're they're, they're not that bad they're like the light's not that bad in comparison i mean illidan that that was a specific naru in a specific moment like that doesn't represent all of the light you know And 
and trying to make Illidan live a destiny that he didn't want to live is a little different than trying to corrupt an entire planet, you know? The Veneration grounds have been despoiled, ruined. Where do we go from here? If they can strike at our most sacred places, how long before they come for the rest of us? The Arathia are survivors. You'll pull through this. Step into the light. You should have seen it. If we took so many Cobas down, sure we took a few flesh wounds, but the flame preserved us and let us carve a bloody swathe through them. The only good Cobas is a when dead Cobas. The only good bug is a dead bug. Uh, yeah, one second. <laughs> Can we log in there? Sacred flame guide your I, own flame. flames. Reyno, do you got some co-op stuff you want to do? The three of us can can hammer it out. Reyno still listening. I, flames. They were raising our dead. I had to kill my sister after watching her get cut down by those monsters. That sounds awful. I'm always so sorry. Prepared. We do what we have to. We always do what we have to to survive. Monslers. Greetings outside. We got dinged up pretty bad by the Cobus. Lost a few friends, killed lots of Cobus though. So there's a positives. You did well. When the star shifts, seek shelter. Oh yeah, okay, so you know, you try narrating the entire fucking storyline while streaming and tell me how many flubs you have. Harathi, oh. friends. The I heard a glyph. Blesses us with victory. Your courage against the dark has saved the day. Yeah, that might be kind of neat if it, if it just retroactively does it all. Let me ping, uh, let me ping Reyna on Discord since he doesn't seem to be listening. Okay, where was... Okay, I need to go grab this glyph really quick. It was when I came over this way. So it's got to be over in this area. Like, maybe through here? Yeah, it is a good zone. Okay, it just pinged again when I flew over this way, so it's got to be, like, further around. Maybe I'll see it on the way back over. There it is. Just uh, just request a guild battle or something, Holy, and I'll jump in. Or that. That'll work, too. We must prepare for Belladar right. to shift. Consecrated our cleanup. Our mission takes a toll. Thank you. It may not have seemed like much, but this is one of our most sacred places. We remember our dead here. We have a lot to remember. We are surrounded by danger. The Arathi spirit can never be broken. Caution is warned. General... The Nerubians. They've opened a new front at Light's Redoubt. Out. 
I search each day for a winning okay. strategy. Just before the Cobus attacked, we received word of a disturbance near Livia's patients. Now we know the cause. We light, we can't survive fighting on two fronts. We have to stop this now. The darkness comes. Flames. Harathi, mount up. Light's redoubt calls for help. We bring hope into the darkness. We'll see. We'll see how it is to, to do it all. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. Livia's patience is overrun. We must buy the villagers time before the reckoning can launch. Hold on, let me go kill this elite really quick. Fung Law. Fung Law. All the way all the way down here, right? Right here. Fung Law. Wait, do you have to request an invite every time? I gotta do some of these anyway, like the higher level ones I gotta do. But this will be a nice uh, boost to your... It'll be a nice boost to your... Stock. Okay, uh, let's see. I mean, I guess it's time to replace these rings. Pray for the flame to show. The final us front. Way. Flames. They tunneled up through the lake bed. Livia's patience has already fallen. Our holy mission Trap door sprung. We need time to get the reckoning ready. Take your friends and hold back the Nerubians for as long as you can. They deserve nothing but death for what they have done to our the people. The day of darkness changed everything. Running on reserves. We have to dark. try and save any. Of our people left alive in Livia's patience. Every Arathi is or was a member of the military. If you can help them, they'll be able to help themselves. If you are lost in darkness, stalwarts, we are the wall today. I mean, it is an Together, entirely militaristic society. We need to evacuate the villages before. I don't know if there's a forgive and forget when it comes to this kind of shit. I'm flying my boat. I'm flying my boat. Didn't like Captain Hook. It's like Captain Hook's ship. Yeah, but you know. Kind of hard. Kind of hard. Okay, let's let's do some battling over here where I can save people at the same time. Right? Yeah. May Baladar. I'll buy you time.
We are the holders of hope. May Belladar stay in the light. Yeah. May Belladar stay in the light. I'm so con I'm, I'm confused on never mind. Where these fuckers are. This one's over here. What up, buddy? Feel the warmth Get of out the here. Everyone is evacuated. The Nerubians are massing for another assault. Fall back. Fall back. All right. Fine. I guess I'll fall back. Before the Nerubians overwhelm us. Good job. I'm surprised the Nerubians aren't fleeing already. In my heart, there is fire. Thank you. Between myself, Valeria, Anduin, and you, I think we managed to save quite a few. The Nerubians abducted many of the rest. We need to help them. Be strong, my friend. The rise of the reckoning. The reckoning is ready. Let's make these spiders pay blood for blood. Board the reckoning and slay the 150 Nerubian forces. Boarding. We have to get out of here, now! Where's Anduin? Oh no! By the light! The light. Return. Even if someone else carries the torch. Nice miss. No! We can't Cross let the king. Why did they take him? We can't Do let the king. Edwin. We can't leave without the king. I dragged him down. I lost track of him. Ash, we can't let them reach Meraldar. Blast them apart. I'm blasting. I'm blasting. What direction am I blasting? This is... I'm fucking blasting. What am I... Fill the area with the... Okay, I'm good. We're blasting! No, she's always had an arm missing. She's had, like, a prosthetic shield attached to her, so... Darkness hungers. Let's give Zalatath's forces a taste of their own shadows. <laughs> she really hit the fan all of a sudden. Oh, I see. Changing perspective.
on them! Very nice. See, it doesn't take much to catch up, you know? Just a little bit of activity, that's all. Just a little bit of activity. And the events have been really good. The events are really good. Let's get Anduin. I hope so too, dear. We don't know what's down there. Reinforcements are on the way. We could wait. We'll lose his trail. You're right! Let's make those monsters pay for everything they've done. Yes! Let's make them pay for everything! The fuck are these people? Flames! They were ready for us. Brace yourselves! look on her face. Oh, we're getting some help from the weird el elf people looking elf people. Troll elves. Troll elves. Tr tr trolls? Trolls. Find Farron the Ruptured Lake. A lamplighter brings What hope. fools we are! Don't give in to fear. Damn it all! We were too hasty and now my people are paying the price. We were fools to think the Rubians were going to be prepared for an incursion. Arathi soldiers are made of stern stuff, but even they will struggle to walk off an airship crash. I will keep everyone here safe. Please go into the field and rescue as many as you can. 